you want to go to Vegas without me? That is totally cool. What are you talking about? Well, you know, Phil and Stu, they're your buddies, and it's your bachelor party, and those two love you. Boys and their bachelor parties, it's gross. It is gross. I just wish your friends were as mature as you. They are mature, actually. You just have to get to know them better. Paging Dr. Douchebag. So live your life. Hey, hey, hey. This is Vegas. Do a night we'll never forget. What happened last night? <laughs> Am I missing a tooth? Oh. <laughs> Whose baby is that? Check its collar or something. I looked everywhere. Nobody's seen Doug. I don't think I've ever been this hungover. What's on your arm? You were in the hospital last night. <laughs> <laughs> the only important thing now is that we find Doug. Where's your car, officers? Oh, God. I think it was just you guys and one other guy. Was he OK? He was fine. Just whacked out of his mind. <laughs> oh, we were messed up. Is there anything you can tell us about what may have happened last night? Congratulations, dude. You got married. <laughs> He is wearing my grandmother's Holocaust ring. I didn't know they give out rings at the Holocaust. <laughs> These gentlemen volunteered to demonstrate how a stun gun is used to subdue a suspect. Wait, Wait, said, what? What? Stop! Stop! In the face! In the face! No! I'm sure you're qualified to be taking care of that baby. Oh my god! in five hours. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Mike Tyson? This is my favorite part coming up right now. He's still got it. <laughs>